Florida now is a safer place for loggerhead turtles, thanks to the federal government. If one recent case is any indication, they need the help. News Channel 5's James Whelan reports on one loggerhead that made a lot of friends after surviving an encounter with a fisherman. TNT was rescued a few months ago after he was accidentally hooked at the Lake Worth Pier. The turtle had a, a fishing hook lodged down between its esophagus and stomach very, very deep. So it had to undergo some surgery to remove that hook. Uh, it took about two and a half months for the surgery to heal. The doctor said he's good to go now, so plenty of friends came out to send him off. We usually get a good turnout for our sea turtle releases, but this one was huge. Um, we're so excited that this many people were here today to say goodbye to TNT, wish him the best of luck. TNT is a rock star. Just look at the hundreds of families that turned out to see him off, and they weren't disappointed. But at some parts it looked like he was saying goodbye because yeah. it popped up its head. And, it, and it, it was like he was happy to be back in the ocean. I thought it was really awesome, really, really good to see the results of what the Marine Life Center does. That's what is amazing that they do all this rescue. NOAA JUST ANNOUNCED THAT THE COAST OF FLORIDA IS A MARINE CRITICAL HABITAT FOR LOGGERHEAD TURTLES. THAT'S GOING TO GIVE MORE PROTECTION AND A BETTER CHANCE OF SURVIVAL FOR TURTLES LIKE TNT AND THIS FUTURE GENERATION HERE. FROM JUNO BEACH, JAMES WHEELAN, WPTV, NEWS CHANNEL 5.